Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I, I did a little workout. For those who are new to my channel, last June, I severely broke my my right hand. You can see the scar, I don't know if you can see the scar right here. Right? I had a plate, as you can see the x-ray on the screen here. I had a plate and huge nails in my hand from June all the way to February, eight months. I couldn't work out. So even though you see me flexing, doing flexing uh, uh, videos, I was working out. I still was working out, even with the plates in my hand, but I was working ar around it. A certain exercise I couldn't do, and that's my pull-ups. I couldn't do them. So I started doing them back this April. I started getting back into it. My hand is still not 100%. As you can see, I tried to do a, a muscle-up. I did it, but the right side was a little rough. I'm getting, it's getting there. So don't, for the trolls, don't say, oh, this guy, I broke my hand severely. Now I'm just getting back into my pull-ups, as you can see. I'll be back to doing 10 muscle-ups really soon. Just gotta work it. I haven't had the place in there since February, but it's still not 100%. Anyway, I did a little running. I did a, some clapping hands pull-ups, as I'll show you in a minute. I did some proprioception training. This is very good. Not only for any age, it's very good. But take a look at it. And uh, this is what I do. I mix my workouts up. I go to places where I've never been before, and I just run up it. That's real proprioception training. When you, you do not know the terrain. Because once you know the terrain, it's no longer, it's not worth it. Because your mind already knows the route. So it's easier. Anyway, enjoy the video. By the way, I ran, I'll end the video with a one minute run. I ran it pretty fast today. I went a little more than 80%. I went like 90%. And I did it almost five minute pay, five minute mile pace. I can run 400 meters in about 59 seconds if I go all out on a track. And this is not to brag. Elite runners, elite, the best in the world in my age group run it that fast. Maybe in a second or two faster, but I'm not a, I don't train to be an elite runner. I train all around. Jack of all trades, baby. Anyway, have a great day. Enjoy the video. Trying to stay young. Wonderful. <laughs> thank I'm you. really impressed. <laughs> uh, thank you, thank you. It's called proprioception training. Let's see what these rocks look like. Believe me, they're not smooth and they are unstable. As you can see, they're unstable. This one is a little smooth. This one is very unstable. See, it moves. Proprioception training. The best proprioception training is the unknown. Once you know your route, it's no longer proprioception training. Real proprioception training is new. It's new terrain. That's when your mind has to work to balance itself, to know what motor units to, to fire up, the slow, the fast, and to coordinate the movement. Have a great day, everyone.
I'm going to end my training with a one minute interval run. You see how fast I run it per, per mile. I was on a mile. So here we go. Five thirteen. Yeah, baby. Yes.